Okay, so we are now into what? Video three of the 30 day, um, 30 videos and seven day challenge. And um, as for going into my little flow of things, as I'm thinking of them and they're coming into my brain, I wanted to um, just quickly also talk about, you know, the, the major blunders that we go through as far as, you know, trying to create a successful anything in our lives. I mean, if you're, um, if you're pursuing a dream or if you're, you know, trying to get your business off the floor or, you know, just anything in general, um, there are so many components that go into, you know, realizing these things and making them come to fruition. So one of the other things that I also see people doing is quitting. Quitting and not giving themselves time to, you know, let their wings just launch and fly and do what they are meant to do. Um, so many people just, oh, it's just so frustrating to see. see. See people just sort of just, you know, they get excited, they're ready to go and then hit a bump in the road and say, oh no, I can't do this, this is too hard or this is taking forever or not having patience to see things come to light. It's very frustrating for me as a, as a daydreamer, as a dreamer, as a dream chaser, as a dream builder, um, to see people just allow themselves to fall and fail and fall flat on their face. And instead of just, you know, wiping off the dust, wiping off the, 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 the stuff that made you fall, they quit. They just say, you know what? I can't, I can't do this. I can't, I, I don't have time for this. This is too much of a headache and quit. And it's just like, really? Like, are you that, that like sensitive to your own self that you can't wipe it off, dust it off and get up and, and try again? I mean, is it that hard to do? Um, if I counted the many numerous times that I have fallen flat on my face, how many times have I tried to do something and it just didn't work? But then guess what? I said, I'm not going to try. I'm not going to give up right now. I'm going to close it up and fix it and try again. You know, you have to push, you have to push yourself to the limits. You have to push yourself outside of your comfort zone. You have to push yourself outside of the limits of what you're comfortable with, because if you don't, you will never grow. If you don't, if you don't give yourself the space to try, if you don't give your, your, yourself the space to allow yourself to fight for what you believe in, you're never going to get anywhere. It's, it's not going to happen. Nothing that you put this much effort into is going to become this big. It just doesn't happen. I, I mean, I don't even know anything, anyone that's ever put this much effort into something and it's, you know, it just skyrocketed. This doesn't happen. It doesn't happen. Um, so those are the things that really frustrate me is people that want to quit. Just quit. Just say, no, I don't want to do it. I'm done. I can't do it. It's too hard. It's taking forever. I'm never going to do it. People are doing it far quicker than I am. Others, blah, 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 blah. It's just noise. It's noise. It's a lot of noise. So, you know, just honest to God, the second that you feel like you're going to quit, give it a rest. Just walk away from whatever is giving you a hard time and just give it a rest and then come back to it because the second that you quit, that second right before you quit, your little magic, your little miracle could have happened and you're going to miss out on that. You're going to miss out on a great opportunity because you chose to quit. So my suggestion to you is to don't quit. Push, push yourself beyond what you can do because you know what? You are so capable of more than you ever imagined if you just dig deep and follow your heart, follow that reason, that reason why you started whatever you started and just go for it because you can do this. I believe in you. So that was my message for today. It got really dark in here because my computer just shut down. The light is off and it's annoying when it does that because you can't see me.